There's a little bit of space out here. Hendrickson's large frame. He is a big man, stood next to me a few moments ago. He may be young, but he is big. Slightly more uh, sprightly is Joe Simmons. He's looking for things. Woodburn, lovely soft hands. Johnny Hill is thundering through. Oh, this is going to be something for the scrapbook of Johnny Hill. The men in Lilac have uh, eventually brought it down, but Craig Maxwell's Craig Maxwell Keys' his arm is out. Advantage coming. Slightly cynical from Johnny Hill there. Crossfield kick. Two men out here. One of them catches it and finishes it, does he? I think Jack Bates has done the impossible there. Yeah, a couple of things to look at here. Is there obstruction? Does he ground it? There's no obstruction. Craig. Yes, Rosie. Stay with your on-field on position. Uh, decision, Stay sorry. Stay with your on-field decision. Yeah. yeah. Perfect. Cheers, Rosie. Williams, they're in the red zone. Exeter will expect to score from here. Bristol will have to scramble. There's where the Chiefs go back to that wrap pattern, pick Sorry, and go. Latching on, they've got a freebie. No, offside advantage. Drum beats ominously. Back against the grain comes the try scorer, Johnny Hill. It's a little bit more like it from the lock forward. Yendel again, presents the ball, the try line is there, and I think Maunda has scampered over. Alec Hepburn reaching, not quite there, he'll place the ball back. Yendel, shadow of the post. Surely, surely for Exeter. Mismatch, there is Simmons's try. Bristol just about hold firm. Pincus has uh, spied something. Padilly is opposite number is uh, covering across. On to the left boot. Pincus has found himself a score. Here's a uh, story with a familiar Joel ending. What can Bristol do it's about it? Advantage, offside. Penalty is being played at the moment. Craig Maxwell Keys is got it. Has got his arm out. No, it's under the feet. They're getting closer. Again, these short-range, rather space. large missiles are firing themselves at the Bristol line. Harry Williams finds Yendel. Not sure whether Yendel was expecting it, but there it was, and another climb towards the line. Exeter enjoying themselves once again, pressing at this line. Kvesic inches away, and I think that has been touched down. Lots of men add their weight to the Bristol rolling mall. I think there's only one thing on their mind. Shirts with high numbers on their back, not used to it, but there it is, rolled over the line, is it? So Fricker is suggesting yes. And we'll have another look at it. He's off the ground there, spins it through. No, his hands on it. Yeah, that's OK for me. Craig, yeah, stay with your on field decision. That is a try. Behind the first man, there's that moment of your That's uh, obstruction. That's clear obstruction. Nothing coming at the moment, though. Exeter still asking questions. The flip out. Kresic, can he get a dot down of his own? Being pushed almost towards the line. Vermeulen. Wrestling and the young man Marcus Street has he got there? I think he has. There is a man out here. Can they finish it off? No, underlined. Full stop. That is the full time score. Exeter have done enough. Bristol certainly did flicker, certainly did play their part. Final score at Sandy Park Exeter 42, Bristol 19.